What's up everybody, Paul Hickey here, and I'm back with your data-driven daily tip. This is number 310. That's 310 times that I've come to you with a free digital marketing or web design tip. But here we go, today's is really cool. And I wanted to call out the fact that it was 310 because I really, really like today's tip. This one is for WordPress content managers, WordPress developers, people that are trying to do cool things with their WordPress site. Have you ever seen a website in the main navigation menu where you click the link and it opens in a modal window or what's called a light box? Well, um, I'm gonna show you today how to do that and you're gonna need obviously a WordPress website and you're gonna need two plugins. You're gonna need one called Pop Up Anything on Click. Then you're gonna need another plugin called Short Code in Menus. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into the back end of your WordPress website and you're gonna install pop up anything on click. When you install and activate pop up anything on click, it's gonna allow you to basically go into pop up anything on the left hand side of the page and create a pop up window. You can style it yourself and it's got different settings, some animations, some timing and things like that. Now you can upgrade to the pro version, but I don't really think you need to. But the cool thing about Pop Up Anything is it allows you to put a short code anywhere on your WordPress website to display the pop up. Now, in order to actually have it display in your main navigation menu, and if you're listening on the podcast, I'm sure you're following along. And if you're watching my screen right now, you're seeing that I'm basically going in and out of the uh, appearance and menus in WordPress. In order to make it go um, show in your WordPress main navigation menu, you have to install the shortcode in menus plugin. Then when you go into your menu, you'll see the ability to add an item that is called a shortcode. And when you go and add the shortcode item, now you can go in and paste the shortcode from the pop up anything plugin into your menu and you can test it and you'll see that it does work. It works quite well. And you're gonna to wanna to do, it's a little bit of trial and error to get the pop-up styled and working the way that you want it. But essentially, this is a very, very low cost way. All plugins are free. You can do this with any WordPress theme. And uh, this is a very, very low cost way to add this awesome functionality to your WordPress website. I gotta give a shout out to my boy Alan Willis for doing this on a client's website recently and inspiring me to make it a data-driven daily tip when I was doing it on another client's website recently. So I really, really appreciate that. Uh, this has been your data-driven daily tip, how to do something really, really cool in WordPress using two different plugins and uh, making a pop-up light box out of a main navigation item in your WordPress navigation menu. For more free digital marketing and web design like this one tips, go to dataoveropinions.com to do business with us or uh, do business with me. Holler at me at uh, paul at datadriven.design. That's the best way to get a hold of me is shoot me an email at paul at datadriven.design. Would love to talk business with you and see how we can work together to up your digital marketing game and get access to me and our experts to help you with personalized execution of your digital marketing strategy, go to datadrivenacademy.org. Um, thanks for listening on the podcast at datadrivenpodcast.com. Check out the Alexa flash briefing at datadrivendaily.com. You can enable it on your Alexa enabled devices by going to datadrivendaily.com. Um, the YouTube channel, I would really, really love it if you subscribed, if you like this tip. If you didn't like this tip, that's fine too. You can go ahead and drop a comment below. Uh, would love to hear from you on the YouTube channel, youtube.com slash Paul Hickey. And to get all of the data-driven daily tips from throughout the week, email to your inbox every Friday morning. Go to datadriven.design slash subscribe. And did you know, marketers and small business owners, that you don't even have to look into your Google Analytics account anymore to check your web data. That's right, it's frictionless. All you need to do is ask Alexa. You do this by going to askdatadrivendesign.com and requesting a free trial to enable 
our premium Alexa skill that allows you to just simply ask Alexa how your web traffic is doing. This has been your data-driven daily tip. I'm Paul Hickey. Thanks and have a great day.